Whenever we travel, we like to know we are going to be comfortable and safe on the train we are traveling on. This journey could be even more relaxing if we knew that the donor products formed part of the train's safety system. No matter the type of train, donor components help to protect passengers' lives in an accident. How this is done and the crucial role that donor products play in the safety systems of trains will be explained in this video, The World of Donor Connections. Delna products are always designed first and foremost with safety in mind. With our company-designed simulation software, Delna develops the most appropriate and cost-effective energy absorption solutions to meet customer needs. Working with the car builders, Delna performs calculations and simulations for different crash scenarios. The goal of this is to optimize our trade connection system to integrate with the customer's crash energy management system thereby ensuring the highest level of the passenger safety. Before being installed on the trains, validation testing is performed on individual components and then on complete crash energy management system to ensure they meet all design and safety requirements. Validation is done both through small and large scale qualification testing. This way our customer can rest assured that Delna's crash energy management system will perform in a predictable and controlled manner if strong forces are applied to the cars. The crash energy management system is composed of several energy absorbing components in the couplers and directly in the car body located at the front and intermediate train interfaces. We divide these components into reversible and irreversible energy absorption devices. Let's turn first to the group of components for reversible energy absorption. These devices are dedicated to absorbing the collision energy in everyday operation, like coupling and cushioning intercalf movements due to braking and propulsion. Reversible devices include rubber draft gears such as spherical rubber bearings, EFT2 and EFT3 rubber springs, as well as rubber donuts. Moreover, in this group we find hydraulic absorbers like single acting dampers, double acting dampers, as well as ring spring buffers. Our range of reversible energy absorption devices permits optimization for specific customer requirements. Rubber springs components are usually installed in low speed coupling, while gas hydraulic dampers are used in more demanding scenarios. The second group of energy absorption components is called irreversible devices. These devices are activated at higher force levels during more severe accidents and can prevent significant damage including vehicle derailment, twisting and overclimbing. In this group we find deformation units, crash absorbers, extrusion bolts and anticlimbers. In a high force impact Derner's crash energy management systems will both provide energy absorption capabilities and play a role in controlling vehicle reactions during higher speed crashes. In this case, the reversible and irreversible components of the coupler and the side absorbers work together to absorb all crash energy. Derner uses both of these component groups to configure crash energy management solutions tailored to the requirements of the customer these requirements are often based on international standards. At Delner, we take passenger safety very seriously. After all, our connection systems are designed to connect not only trains, but first and foremost, people.